You hear that? That's as loud as it gets. That's the sound of a fully electric car called the Zen that's turning a lot of heads. I've been down in Beverly Hills with a guy with a $330,000 Bentley next to me, and I got more attention about people running around this car wanting to know what it is, where we got it. These silent cars are not for road trips. They only go up to 25 miles an hour. But around town, the makers say that's more than enough. The average speed of downtown traffic is about 17 miles an hour. And I use the tortoise and hare effect because you basically can keep up with the flow of traffic and everybody stops at the same stop sign. A new Zen starts around 12,000. It seats two and goes about 30 miles on an overnight charge. It's built on the body of a regular car, unlike this Corbin Sparrow. I've gone well above the speed limit in it. Uh, it's uh, computer limited to 70 miles an hour. Using batteries and motorcycle parts, the one-seater Sparrow was not around for long. Its range is also about 30 miles, but is it safe? The scariest parts are when I'm on the freeway and someone leans out of their car to take a picture of me with their cell phone. But for the road tripper and all of us, with a range of 400 miles, there's this 82 Mercedes that runs on what? Used straight veg oil from an Indian restaurant. It's a modified diesel engine that'll still take petroleum if you get in a bind, but this green fuel is free. It's something that a restaurant would pay to have picked up um, and removed from the restaurant. So how do they all stack up to this classic Nash Healy? It was really a high style, high performance sports car that kind of competed with Jaguar back in the 50s. This 1953 two-seater actually got about 20 miles per gallon on good old gasoline, back when a gallon only cost a quarter. In Berkeley, Jonathan Bloom, Cron 4 News.